solves the mystery. Starring in alphabetical order, Al. From our house, Shannon Doherty. From State Elsewhere, Stephen Burke. From Al, Benji Gregory. From 227, Jack A. From Valerie's family, Danny Ponce. From Black to Riches, Douglas Steele. From the Golden Girls, Betty White. Mary Wick. From Rags to Riches, Heidi Ziegler. Mm -hmm. yeah. I'm telling you, Sid, my memoirs are going to sell a million. Well, every kid in America will want to know about my life on Melmac before it went kablooey. Yeah, yeah, my new Saturday morning series with a brilliant new cap every week. Sydney, you've got no vision. I'll be bigger than Ollie North. Yeah. Well, I've got to go, Sid Meister. I feel inspiration coming on. Agents. Now, let's see. Great memoirs always start with the family life.
Frank and Joe Hardy. We've heard a lot about you, Ted. I thought the Hardys were both boys. We're the Hardys, Ted, with the teeth. Common mistake. Then he saw her, his new client. A real glamour put with a heart of ice. I am Vicar Alfred, Mona Moore. Thank you for coming. I'm sure you've met my other guests, Max the Mole, and the lady in red. Sean, I'm sure. Oh! Ahem, <clears throat> so, we meet again, eh, kid? Oh, oh! I've asked you all here because of your fame as great sleuth. Uh, I mean, sleuth. Years ago, a fortune was hidden somewhere in this house. I will split that fortune 50-50 with whoever finds it. 50-50? No way! 50-40! After all, you need our expertise. All right, all right. Whatever you say. They won't be around anyway. <laughs> They're on your own. Let the start begin! Kid. Better yet, follow the Hardys. They seem to know where they're headed. Do you hear a, hear a voice? No, just yours, Countess. Uh, must be all the excitement. Knowing I'm this close. As for my guests, they're all yours. <laughs> Once they find the horse. I'll take good care of them. <laughs> <laughs> Elf Loves a Mystery will return after these messages. Johnson in a crumpled suit. Step aside. Al on the list one. It's something from Alvin and the Kimmel. Look at our new season, Rocky Girl. We'll be strutting in high style this year. <laughs> huh? Well, have you ever seen a cuter little pup? Why, even old Lou's got the laid-back look of a casual canine. And Fritz Carlos Spencer has never looked more dapper. The whole gang's put 
counting on the dogs just for you this Saturday morning. And uh, good luck in finding that treasure, my kid. I will, Countess, I will, but you look here. I'm onto the snoops who are going to find your lost fortune. Countess was beginning to realize how hard it is to find good help. Who's that? The guy who dreamed you up. The what? Yeah, you're just a figment of my imagination. I'm nobody's figment, Buster. I love this dame. What a character. is our home, Fraggle Rock. Of course, we share it with the doozers. Those busy little guys are always building something. Take a candle away. Worry for another day. Let the music play. Down in Fraggle Rock. Ooh, a Fraggle. Whoa. Uh, look, Mom, I caught a Fraggle. <laughs> Diet Coke is the perfect soft. 
Okay, this week, Bob's and Big Bees and I will host all your Saturday morning favorites right here on NBC. You can say that again. I'm Jack Ed. This week, folks. Kid and his cronies had hightailed it back upstairs. Hot tip about a wild woman with a large eye. On Melmac, that combination would have won a beautiful. said to put the pyramid on your head and increase your cosmic powers. Huh? Where are my manners? You must be Mona's guest. And the that hair from Baker's. Ow! Oh, I'm just passing through myself on the way to a new age convention in San Diego. What? Well, I have to admit I'm a little over my head with this pyramid business. I better just stick to my reliable crystal ball. Reception's on the blink again. All I get is a hairy guy with a big nose and an attitude problem. Hairy little guy, huh? This character just wrote herself out of this mystery. We're moving on. Hey, gummy bears, hit it. You know, in gummy land, there's nothing we like better than a good night's sleep. Unfortunately, we won't get much. Not with trolls on the loose. All right. Of course, we've always got our secret weapon. Guys! Let's get him down. Gummy, you put him. You can't beat Gummy Berry Judas. What fun. Well, I can barely wait to start our new season. <laughs> but enough about us, Gummy. I promised Elf we'd help you kids. And Grammy Gummy doesn't break a promise. Here goes. Three apples tall, colored blue. Search a trunk for your next clue. Three apples tall and colored blue. Sounds like my last date. No! The Smurfs! Oh, I love those little guys. And there's the trunk we've got to search. Can we have a look? Well, I'm not used to a nine-year-old detective can do my private things, but I'll go for it. Oh, you are 
are truly evil. You're too kind. I was a kid, especially Veronica. She always wears these great clothes. The new Archie's. What's that? Heads up, kids! We're coming at ya. The new Adventures of the Archie Gang is running back along with Betty and Veronica, still best friends and still trying to one up each other. Reggie's here too, wild as ever. <laughs> Don't forget your kid and me, Archie, in an all. a yellow door. You'll find the clue you're looking for. Thanks, Arch. We'll see you Saturday. Should we go in? I'll handle this. There's a new show on. I didn't want to miss it. New show? Welcome to the game show where brothers and sisters can win a whole ton of prizes and money, too. Simply by showing how well they really know each other. It's I'm Telling. Knowing my sister, I'd have to say she would say nerd wee. <laughs> nerd wee. Oh, 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 oh. You know, you're out of town. There's no telling what they'll say. Answer correctly, and you can take a trip to the Pick a Prize Arcade. It's a gold mine of fun, starting this Saturday on I'm Telling. I just love a good game show. Yeah, and this one's gonna make us rich. Just listen. Here's your question, Joe. Where do your brothers say is the best place to hang a stocking? On the fireplace. Right. And Frank. What bird is your sister as wise as? Watch it, Frank. An owl? Right. Well, what's the clue? What? And a fireplace. To the parlor. Yeah. Don't you want to come? Thanks, kid. I got other work to do. Into the middle of the room, all of you. Good thing. Just in time for the grand finale. You get over there with the rest of us. Uh, pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. The money will be split. 50-50. I'll take 99%. My butler gets the rest. Sounds fair to me, Countess. But what about our there? I mean, we found it. You won't be needing money where you're going. Back into the vault. After you've moved all the goods into the parlor, we're sealing you in forever. And don't try anything foolish. My butler's wanted in nine states. And not by good housekeeping. Yes, yes, yes. Get the money! Run for it! At your service. I've been undercover on this case for two months. And this is not Countess Mona Moore. She is a fan dancer, a pickpocket, and an all-round no good. She's Bubbles Clover. Ooh, I hate that name. Bubbles. Ooh. The fortune rightfully belongs to the lady in red. 
It was stolen years ago from her family and hidden here by Bubbles' long-dead partner in crime. <laughs> well, I've got to hand it to you, kid. It took your crime-solving genius to break this case wide open. All in a day's work. I hope this covers your expenses, kid. Somehow it doesn't seem like enough. Thank you. Where'd he go? I saw that done on television once. What's the big idea? You're not old enough for some stories, Benji. Maybe we'll finish this one in a few years. At least I still have the money. Well, big bucks, who'd you expect? George Washington? Ha! <laughs> Kill me! Uh... Elf Loves a Mystery will return after these messages. New Chicken Little, New Chicken Little Sandwich, New Chicken Little, Kentucky Fried Chicken made you so nice. Oh, I love your 39 cent price. You. New Chicken Little, you cost just a little, but people love you a lot. The cat owner's guide to crave behavior. The stare. The hint. The performance. It all means give your cat crave with the taste cat fur fur. His seafood recipes, poultry recipes, and original recipes. All made with protein. Not the victory and the reward. Oh, my kitty cat. Crave, crave. It's the taste cat fur fur. You know what this flat old potato chip is, huh? It's a doggone shame it's not a ruffled potato chip. I tell you for true. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Ruffled fried potato chips, the taste won't leave you flat. I guarantee. Well, I think that's about enough excitement for one day. Remember my adventure? Sure. Better yet, tune into NBC Saturday morning, and you'll see all the friends who helped you out in the shows of their own. Oh, you're the greatest. No, I can't wait till Saturday. You ready for a date at the house? Yeah, I think it is. Some things, kid, are just too good for words alone. <laughs> Saturday mornings are made just... The all-new Fraggle Rock. It's more music and mischief with Alvin and the Chipmunks. And Archie and the gang come to life in the all-new Archie's Cartoon Show. Awesome, huh? It all starts tomorrow morning. Chance.